Thank you, everyone. I'd like to turn the spotlight to a couple of issues that are really important to folks across the Midwest right now, and those are the issues of trade and the tariffs. Uh, one in five jobs in Iowa is tied directly to trade. So this is an area that our manufacturers, our farmers, and our ranchers are very, very interested in. But right now, the tariffs that we have on those products are overwhelming, and it is hurting our farm and agricultural income. So I continue to visit with the president about these issues and encouraging him not only to get the trade deals done as soon as possible, in particular USMCA and long-term China, we need those done, but also to remove those tariffs so that we can move forward. Um, particularly harmful is the Section 232 tariffs on steel and aluminum. Our manufacturers are having a very hard time with that right now. Uh, a little bit from an ag perspective as well. When I was crossing the state, I was visiting with many young farmers and one young couple in particular, they're so proud to be family farmers. They have a hog operation, uh, but what they have been forced to do is take off farm employment, non-agricultural employment because of the tariff issue right now. A lot of these young farmers, young families are really, really struggling. So we want to make sure that we're seeing resolution there. But we really need to put some pressure on the Democrats as well. They need to be willing to come to the table, sit down, and work through these trade issues. So I am hoping that Speaker Pelosi will bring the USMCA up as soon as she can and make sure she's getting that through the House and sent over here to the Senate so that we can get our work done as well. But again, it's imperative that we continue working on these trade deals to make it better for our farmers, our ranchers, and of course our manufacturers as well. Thank you.